Hello guys, this is Karen, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm doing a copycat wonderful world tutorial in the last video behind me. As you can see, we built the redstone shop, well, the flashing lights redstone shop. And yeah, it's all done. It was quite a long video to be fair, and in today's video, as I said from the last video, we are going to begin building the wonderful school that's all the way over here. So, we haven't built anything in this area f since this I'm assuming the animal pens which was the first video I did when I came back so yeah it's nice to get the school done and it's going to take more than one video so in today's video we're just going to work on the outside so as you can see I've marked out a path now if you've built the animal pens which I have you want to just be right up against this and then add the path there also if you haven't built this path already connecting up to there if you go to this path that's in front of the to-do list, you want two blocks, skip two grass blocks and then drag the path out that way. And this is the box where the school's going to go and if you haven't done this then you'll find out when we come to building it. I'm zooming. If not, you want to build that first. So, this path, just in case you haven't got the animal pens, you want to go to the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13th and 14th block, so you want to have 12 blocks of grass in between there, and there'll be 12 in that direction as well on the other side of the path, just in case you didn't have that path. So, we're going to get straight into building it. So, the first thing we want to do is build a doorway which is how we start most of the builds off so there we go we got a doorway yay and that's the end of this video <laughs> i'm joking obviously i am so what we want to do now is double this doorway up like that so it's kind of like an extra row there and then you want to stick one out on each side like that so it's kind of like a what's it called a japanese garden type thing if uh, if it was like one higher like that and then had a gap like that that's not how they look but there's an extra row but yeah that's what you want to have it look like okay so what you want to do is to the left hand side of each of these doors you want to add a total of three six seven eight more blocks of yellow so this should be nine if you count this one so that's one two three four five six seven eight nine so that's nine i grabbed the wrong resource i just realized um let me grab that there we go this is yellow wall by the way so that's two three four five six seven eight nine so it should be three blocks away from each path so far and then you want to add a yellow concrete on each side and that is how long the front of the build is so you want this yellow concrete on the corner to be a total of three four five six seven high so that's one already two three four five six seven high and then here again three four five six seven high there we go then if you go up one and in one and then just drag a massive row of yellow wool all the way across like that and that's pretty much how high the classrooms go to be fair okay do we want to finish this wall yes so what you want to do right if you go to the left hand side you want to skip two and then place two yellow wool and then this yellow wool you want to drag out a total of six more so that's a total of seven if you count this one so that's one two three four five six seven and do the same on this side so one two three four five six seven and there we go so it looks like this now if you go up and in one here with some yellow wool like that so just what it looks like so far and then you want to just add four blocks here and that is all the yellow wool on the front done. The rest of the build is literally white stained glass. So, um, for the front anyway. So let's fill all this up with the white stained glass panes. My bad, I forgot to mention that is panes. So let's fill this up like this. Fill this up like this. As soon as we fill this up. <laughs> Um, so there is classrooms on the inside. We're going to work on the classrooms in the next video. Whether we're going to get all of them done is a good question. But we'll try to get most of them done. We might just do the bottom floor and then work on the top floor. So, yeah. Let's fill this up. And there we go. So that is what the front of the school should look like. And 
must I say, it looks kind of interesting. Um, okay, so on these sides, you want, after this yellow block, yellow concrete, you want a total of three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen yellow walls. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen yellow wall, one yellow concrete. And then what you want to do with this yellow concrete is just build this all the way up and then dra drag and connect it up to this yellow concrete and then all that's going to be yellow wall. Okay, and you want to do this on the same side, uh, same thing on this side, so drag the yellow wall across. You should be two blocks away from each path as well by the way, if all of this is working properly. So yeah, let's connect this up like this there we go and then you want to go up one and in one and then just drag this across here yellow concrete this is this is not yellow wool there we go and also what you want to do just to get a head start on the roof you just want to add one yellow wool going from the front all the way to the back and connect up with that concrete it is kind of strange how this roof is but it looks cool so this is what you should have right now a massive box so you want to fill in this side, this side, and that side in with yellow wool. So we're going to do that. And while I do that, I'm going to talk. I um, never use, use potions in the video. And I don't really cut out just to make the video longer. So yeah. Um, yeah, so it's weird. This is like, this is episode 31 and we're building the school. And then this could be 32 or 33 when we finish this, depending on how quick we can knock out them classrooms. There's signs in there and we're going to have to write all the signs. There's like eight signs in a room with writing on. And some of them are small, some of them are big. So it's like a mix between them. We've got corridors to do and stuff like that. And the school's just a nice big project to get out of the way and just a nice project in general to get done we haven't really built over here for a while and this is the last build over at this side apart from the milky bar so yeah um we might as well have got it done and we've been very busy doing one build builds recently so getting a few of these builds done well bigger builds is just a nice way to finish things off um, not finish things off that sounds like I was quitting tutorials I'm not quitting tutorials just to get that out there it's a, just a nice way to like finish doing a few one builds by doing a nice big memorable build such as the school um, this is probably his one of his biggest things it, there's this the movie studio and the hotel and they go over there so yeah one day we will build them as well but for now the school is the project we're working on so there we go all the walls are filled in okay what we want to do now is you want to add go to this back wall and add one yellow wall going inwards like that so it should look like this and what you want to do is double up all of these yellow wall so you want two blocks on each of them apart from one of them and that one is the back one so this back one should have one yellow wall the rest should have two so it should look like this okay now what you want to do is add a row of yellow concrete going all the way around this box and then after that you want to add one row of yellow wall and then we've got to go up again so yeah this is i think i don't know there's no really re big use i can think of to do with this little like bell type shape on the school there's no i don't think there's redstone there there's i don't think there's no redstone at all really um but yeah so that that's the roof done i th i think this is just here just to make it look kind of nicer I guess so what you want to do now is go up one and in one and then add a row of yellow concrete going around and then you want to keep going up one and in one for four rows and you just want to switch resources every time so you've got a yellow concrete then a yellow wall then another yellow concrete and another yellow wall so let's fill this up uh, like 
this there we go and let's add some more yellow wall going around here a uh, yellow wall yellow concrete and then one more yellow wall and it's getting really small now so that means we're almost done with the outside yay and there's the top part done and it's um okay so this should be four by three which is good okay let's add a yellow block there and a yellow block there a yellow concrete so on the short sides and that is just where the bell is so yeah then what you want to do this is the weird bell part so right he here you want to add two yellow concrete and that's on the back as well then what you want to do is go up one and in one for the some yellow wool there and some more yellow wool there like that okay then you want to do this and alternate for four rows so that's one two three four so whatever's underneath it is what you want to place the different one on top of it so yeah so it should look like that that's good okay so what you want to do now is go out one and up one and then add a literally entirely made out of um yellow concrete this next row so we can just do that okay what we could well nothing's really in there but okay so then you want to just add a full row of yellow on top of it like this there we go then you want to add a little yellow one yellow concrete just go in one so you want to like have this type of shape there we go then you want to add yellow wool just a flat yellow wool going in one and up one again and then add two yellow concretes there and that is the outside of school pretty much done there's a bit more details we're going to add on now so right down here you want a door the floor is white wool so you can add that there like that and there's the oak doors you want a sign here and it says the smarty pants school so smarty pants school you want to add some flower pots either side of the path and then add some poppies there like that which is looking good okay so now what you want to do, torch is on the front, there's a torch right here on each of the yellow concretes at the top, Oop, that was a weird glitchy thing there, there we go, so that's looking good, that's the front of the build pretty much done, on the, the short sides you want to add a torch there and there, right on the ends, and the same on these sides, so there and there, then on the back wall, you want to add torches in the exact same places there and there none on this top row and there's no more and that's what they should look like now going up on top of the first yellow concrete row well the only yellow concrete row that's full on the flat level you want to add torches in the corner there we go then going up on every yellow concrete corner on this up part you want to add torches like that that's looking good and you want to add some torches there and there and then on the back as well there and there there we go this is looking great and then finally on the top you just want to add a torch there 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 and there and is that it that is actually all the torches on the school done so feel free to pause the video for them torches there and let me just get a better view like that so feel free to pause the video for anything you need there and there are the torches on the front 
and then they're literally on the sides just got a copy and paste it really on these like that okay so that's the outside of the school done um we could work on the inside but i kind of want to do something else there's a little house that i mentioned in a few videos ago and it goes right here and it's by the name of boney boney's little hut i think home and we're gonna just go ahead and build this so you want to grab birch planks and birch not birch um bone blocks oak planks spruce planks stone brick stairs oak stairs stone bricks torches light gray concrete and that concrete powder concrete powder and that's all we're going to need for now so what you want to do if you're at this site right here where this grass block is you want to skip five one two three four five and place three blocks of birch plugs so it's in line with this three here and we're going to break these out and then what you want to do if you go one to the left and right of each side you just want to break these out and you just want to break these few blocks out all the way here and okay is that correct yeah so you want to have after the birch planks you want to add some light gray concrete like concrete powder like that and you want it to be a five by five area and you just want to flatten this down and if you are the same as me you should see this little lava part here just add so if you block that up and then if you come down into the lava room there is more updates here but for now all you want to do is break these three blocks out and change them to oak planks so where the hole used to be and then if you go to the left then three are now oak planks so let's fill this up with light gray concrete powder and then we can build the house because it's literally five by five okay let's get rid of them okay so what you want to do in each corner you want to build up three high with bone blocks you won't really be able to see this wall but let's just build it there for the sake of it then you want to add a row of spruce here okay on the third block high level then on the inside you just want to add a spruce wall and then add, break the middle one out and add a oak plank by the way bony is a skeleton horse just to be clear and there's another oak plank got it there's torches above the middle on each side like that gotta break these blocks out okay you want to so for the roof you want to add, grab a stone brick stair oak stone brick oak stone brick and just alternate and all we want to do is do it like this so like go to the middle of the house so three in that direction five in this direction then copy and paste that but alternating between the blocks like that add a stone brick there there's a bit of grass we are gonna add in a second but yep yeah, there's a torch on there some torches there okay now for the inside you want to basically do what you did here and just add the stair pattern on the inside so you won't be able to see it should look like that there we go this is looking good gonna grab new resources now we're gonna grab a oak sign nope I don't fence gate birch sign a what am I looking for a chest a hay bale and a light gray carpet and some grass and a torch and a skeleton spawner skeleton spawner <sighs> skeleton horse and you want to grab a saddle as well so on the right hand side you want to add a hay bale with a light gray piece of carpet on top and then add a chest there you want to add three oak fences there and a skeleton horse we needed a oh dear oh dear this is not what i wanted to do okay we're gonna have to kill some skeleton horses we need a big skeleton horse preferably there we go and then you want to add a saddle on it even though you can just ride it without a saddle but copycat has it like that so we're gonna have it like that there's a sign right here and it says boney's home so let's get that done i did literally today as i'm recording this build boney's home so yeah i was like we might as well get this done so yeah 
there's Boney's little home and now it's just grass changes so what you want to do is add a grass block there and fill that area up there and okay there is a few more changes so let's get into it uh, what you can also do is grab a dandelion and an oxide daisy okay so on this side you want to add a grass block there and a grass block there also a grass block there and then mine these two blocks out here so it should look like this on this side you also want to place a torch right here like that on this side you want to add two grass there and the rest is fine apart from you want to get rid of this block and change that to a grass like that so feel free to pause the video if need be and there's also a torch so if you go to this block here the right hand side edge of the house um, and add a little torch there there we go you can also add a dandelion there to the right of it and to the left of this path you want to add an oxide daisy and you want skip one add a dandelion skip two add a dandelion and then add a dandelion there as well and that is Boney's house done and that is going to be today's episode done actually what I want to do is kind of change them little grass blocks out so the dirt just so it looks nicer so yeah that's Boney's house done yay that's the newest build as I'm recording this that he has built which is nice we've got a the newest build in copycats world done and we've got the outsiders school done okay is there anything else I want to do in this video hmm good question good question uh, is there any like torches I've missed I'm just checking uh, my resources right now um, did we add the torches down here yes we did okay so um if we want to this you don't really need to do but right here at the end of this oak path you can just add two poppies there's two poppies there i'm assuming that's marking out a build i don't know could have just been there um so that's what we're gonna do just add them there and we're gonna add a few more torches as well over here there's a few torches on this grass area so waste seeds free if you go diagonal there's a torch there then follow that to the little path add a torch there there's also a little lamp post which i don't really like these lamp posts to be fair so if you go right here skip free place an oak fence you want to build this up seven high so that's one two three four five six seven come out one add a spruce log there you want to also grab a oak trap door add that there and then surround it with torches there's a lamp post and yeah i guess that can be the end of today's video unless there's did i add a torch okay yeah them torches are already placed there um so is oh okay over here let's just add this on we're doing some extra stuff now uh there's a torch right here in line with this last trap door on the right on the back hand side and if you go right up against this path here you want to skip three place a torch skip one place a torch and that is them torches done it just adds some more lighting to this area so yeah so that's going to be the end of today's video and yeah so let's end the video on the ideas board so thank you guys for watching this video and bye